And hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Middle Earth. If you've watched my previous videos, and if not, just welcome to Middle Earth, I guess. I've chosen for this video to go with the Men of Dale, which is to the north. As you can see on the map. I have absolutely no idea what the background story is with these guys. As far as I know, they were settled here recently, during this time. Right there. And the bottom left hand side of my screen, as you can see. And so they got attacked by dragons, and there's a bunch of different culture things at the beginning of the, uh... At the beginning of the character selection screen, or the team selection screen, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, they have quite a decent little backstory to them. I'm not going to rush into anything in this playthrough like I did with Gondor. You see where that got me. If not, I recommend you go watch it. <laughs> if you like seeing people get the crap beaten out of them, that's the video to watch. My Lord. I'm gonna go see what is to the east. Because I have no idea what I'm going up against. Bandits, by the looks of things. I'm gonna put a defensive structure in this building. I just guess anyone attacks from that way. I know that there are the elves in this forest down here, which I'll make an alliance with at some point if I'm not already aligned with them. I'm aligned with the dwarves, which is good, I guess. I'm at war with those guys. I know there are elves down to the way down here. To the westish. Uh, I got the dwarf capital right there, which is always good. I have an ally right next to my home base. Do I have a diplomat of any kind? Don't start off with diplomats in this. I noticed. But yes, if you haven't watched my uh, previous videos, I recommend you go watch them. But in this video, I this video, yes, in this video, I swear to God that I shall uh, take my time and uh, not rush into a needless slaughter like I did with Gondor. But hopefully, I won't be constantly under attack by everything that moves when with uh, this team. I'm I ain't giving him a check name out. Ugh. Hard one. Okay, there is a rebel settlement over there. Preferably means you got some nice ranges, that's for sure. My lord. Approaching. Well the looks of things I control this entire section here. Ah right. Crap. I got enemies directly over that way. Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey. Keep those things, get some markets growing. Get some trade up so I can get more get uh reinforcements. Reinforcements, my bad. Slur the day, and I just got up from the lazy shit. <laughs> My videos, as if any of you have ever watched them, they're usually really early in the morning or really late at night. <laughs> Otherwise, I get interruptions all the time, which I probably will. By any second now, somebody's going to walk into my room and start talking in a high-pitched voice because it will be my shit, their little hister, uh, sister. Approaching quietly. Approaching quietly. Horses. King Dane. Glory to both our people. Uh, it's good that I have the dwarves right next to me. I have an ally for once, like, directly next to me instead of miles away. Whereas Gondor was getting, like, no aid from anybody for the road. Turn a little bit of dust on my screen that said I had minus three turns. Damn the dust! Damn it to hell! Any second now, somebody's going to come in my room. I know it. Here we go. That's the love of God. Do you know what this signal means? This signal means don't make any damn noise, I'm recording. Uh-huh. Don't make any damn noise, I'm recording. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? So 
same thing as with Gondor, Flames of War, Stirring in all the Middle Earth, blah blah blah. You guys can pause that to have a look. I've already read it all. The Orcs of the Misty Mountains. Those guys are over. Now, I don't think they conquered that, but I know there's a Mordor force right here in this general vicinity. Kind of. Or he's right there, I'm not entirely sure, but the Orcs of the Misty Mountains are over there on these mountains, in the Misty Mountains. So I don't really care about them, to be honest. They're uh, not a threat to me, yet. Yeah, I think I'm going to make like a uh, a little sign to stick on my front fucking conservatory door that I'm in. Because uh, my room's like based in the conservatory and shit. I, yeah, don't fucking ask why. The room's... It's bigger than the room's upstairs. The room's upstairs is fucking tiny as shit. Yeah, not enough room to put all my stuff in, but uh, I'm going to stick a giant ass room. Say, fucking, I'm recording. Piss off. That will work. No, it won't. It'll completely ignore it. Stables, town guard. Uh, I'm thinking town guard for there. Maybe. Never. Colonial farming. Chicken. Chicken! Okay, town guard for there. Oop. What did I put for there then? I didn't put anything for there. Chickens. River Run. Seat of House Tully. R wrong mod. My bad. Where's my spy at? You can go up this way. Oh. Approaching quietly, my lord. Up there is the dwarves. My lord. Let's find out where this settlement is exactly that belongs to the enemy. <laughs> this video will come to you in glorious HD, by the way. I've finally figured out how to uh, fix that up. We bring word for you. Now, to be honest, I'd rather have a alliance with these guys. These are the elves to the southish in the forests. Uh, if you remember in the movies when Aragorn, Legolas, and Boromir and all that went into the forest and met the elves and the, the queen that whispered the Frodo and shit. It's that guy. Those lot. Accept this wonderful so make with pleasure. An pact with them. Pleasure. Farewell. That means I have allies to the west and north. Which is always a good thing. Do I have allies? That and lots of trade routes. We need trade routes. It's another thing that fucking Gondor didn't have and led to their downfall. No allies, no trade routes. No sending out spies to find out where the hell the guys are. Stat of Dale, pot of cooks are no clean business. In other words, that's to smack the lowers over your head. Damn peasants! Face the wrath of my cane. Was there anything to build in that place? No, there was not. Where's my spy? There he is. My lord. You will find the rebel settlement or I will fucking kill you. My lord. You will find the rebel settlement. Well, not rebels, they're whatever their names are. They don't seem they seem to be quite a long way away though. If you look on the map right there, it's a large bit of territory that they have. But that right there is more dark than anything else, so it might be. My spy is near their capital, or their city, or whatever you want to call it. All I know is they're right next to my borders, and I don't like people that close to my borders. Makes me nervous. Thing is, I would usually say oh, I'm not going to get to war with these guys very fast, because I don't want to be annihilated, but I'm already at war with them. It's the default setting, man. I'm already at war with the bastard. Approaching quietly. Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey planned out. What I should have really done is looked for a road in some description. But uh 
Alright, if I'm not that smart. That would be the intelligent thing to do. No, no, no intelligence from me. Go away. If you want intelligence, go to somebody else's channel. If you want random gibberish sprayed at you at a constant speed of about 12,000 parsecs, don't correct me on that. Then, this is the channel for you. Approaching quietly. Approaching Where the hell are they? Quietly. Probably getting like people commenting on my videos right now. He's out of the way, dumbass! Turn around, you dumb bastard! I'm trying! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Sheep farming. Population. Faster I get population up, and faster I can get everything else. Especially in that guy's place. Food reduction for being that. My lord. Is that found there? Reminds me of the fucking word from uh, Skyrim of the elves. But the elves are nice, peaceful people, kind of, in this, I guess. Hmm. <sighs> All I can do is hope they don't attack me for quite a while. My lord. Approaching quietly. But there are like no roads in this place. At all. <laughs> there are no roads. No roads. I'm not sure what uh team I'm going to be doing after this. So either you guys put in the comments what uh team you would want me to pick, whether or not it's Smolder or Isengard or whatever. I don't mind, I'll do whatever you say. I'll dance around on the pedestal. Yay! <laughs> A dancing bear. A dancing bear will distract you from my shit dancing. Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey planned out. Yeah, just stick in the comments. Whatever you want me to do next. If you want to see Isengard or Mordor or whatever. If not. Then, after I've finished with the Dales, hopefully I have defeated people on the Dales and not just got my ass kicked, like I did with Gondor. Then, uh, I'll be covering the Starks on a... Westeros Total, Mo uh, Total War mod. That is done by... I think I put a... This, I th think I put a link to their main website where you can download it and everything on my first Gondor video, if you want to look at that. Like I said, go watch my other videos, or I'll kill you. I left out the kill you part, but uh... I was trying to be nice! Fuck me, it's hot in here. But yeah, as usual, I will be trying to make my videos about an hour long each. I had one person send a request for me to do hour long videos, so... Can't remember who it is, I'd say your name, but uh sorry. Where did they put that spy? Off. Oh. There he is. My lord. Approaching quietly. There seems to be like a giant field with these guys. I cannot find their flipping capital. Actually it's probably like way over to the uh, east. Like way at the edge of the map. I'm going completely the wrong direction. Yeah, hopefully they, like, have other people to contend with, like bandits or somebody else to, to I get more men in order to crush them like the puny, pathetic weaklings they are. I say that, but it is on very hard difficulty because that's what the mod recommends and... Ooh, I found this element. I, I found it! Ah, 
It's under siege. By who, I wonder? Should have just really followed that road. That's what you usually do, but, uh... All that walking could have been prevented. Well, now I know that if I take that settlement, I've taken that entire section of land. My lord, approaching quietly, approaching <laughs> quietly. The dwarves just took. <laughs> okay. Um, never mind. The dwarves have taken it. Which is okay. There can be their problem. <laughs> uh. Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey planned out. That's fine with me. If they want to take that, that's uh saves me dealing with them. This is gonna be a really purely defensive video, isn't it? It's just gonna consist of me building, 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 building. Yes, this video may be a bit shorter than one hour, considering the fact that I have to go out later on. At some point, I have no idea what time I'm supposed to be going out. But, uh, I shall get someone to inform me of this. <sighs> but the video will be as long as it can, probably. name, and usually I don't collect them from names, but hell, more heirs, the more people I can use as generals. My lord, approaching quietly, I shall continue tomorrow. I'll take these lands. Lands down here. One second. Damn it! Go away, son of a bitch. I'm trying to squish a fucking bug that was in my window. I hate bugs. Mainly spiders, but I think they're arachnids, not bugs. Blah, 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 blah. Stop being so damn technical, YouTube. They're bugs if I say they are, damn it. I would just like to say, I know there was a lot of gaps between the uh, Gondor walkthrough, but I try to complete, and I'm one of the people that, uh, if I start something, I, I will try to finish it. Even if nobody likes it. <laughs> Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey planned out. The fact me, the dwarves are like completely... Gonna destroy that entire bloody nation, and I'm gonna have nobody to fight. I'm gonna have to go help Gondor, which is, uh. I could call the video to the aid of Gondor. I don't know. The Beacons of Minas Tirith, or something like that. I don't know. The titles write themselves, really. The titles usually actually have something to do with, uh. what's going on in the video. Hence, the fall of Gondor was my last Gondor video. <laughs> because they got annihilated. Partly due to my uh, lack of intelligence and fucking rustiness at the Total War games. I'm a very defensive Total War player. I usually stay away from the fights for quite a while, build up all my armies, and then eventually go aid my allies that I've made over the time for resources. Stick with those allies that have been good to me and aid them in taking their lands. Just trying to get a basic overview of what the lands are. I know the north is going to be pretty much like dominated by the dwarves any second. So we're going to go to the south, or at least south of here, maybe. I'll let the I'll I'll once I get more men, I'll probably aid the dwarves like I was saying with aiding your allies. I'll try to get some more men. 
Oh, the dwarves and taking out the rest of those dudes. No, it's been failed. I don't care. My lord. So let's go south and have a look, shall we? A lot of bandit camps. A lot of bandit camps. By the way, for uh, requests, uh, the free peoples of Endor, or whatever they're called, the people to the very far west, northwest-ish, over to the corners, right next to the high elves to the right. Hmm? Let's say the authority. Who are those guys? Alright, those guys again. Uh, those guys are my non-recording, kind of break from recording team, so uh, I can't... But, uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. I could start recording what I've already done with them. Quietly. Ooh, they're over this side as well. These people are everywhere. I can't turn without bumping into them. Just leave me alone. I don't like you. That's right, YouTube. I don't like you. Go away. I joke. Please don't leave. Oh, God. It's hot in here. Do -do 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 -do. I'm just gonna go north now and see if how many guys are in that little settlement. Expand my Dale Empire a little bit. War declared. There you go, that's them. The free peoples of Endral. That is my free save about all the recordings so that I can just muck around and uh, take my time kind of thing. As if not to bore you guys. Yes, I don't really mind doing another playthrough of it. I could for this record the purposes of keeping you guys happy if you want me to do a playthrough with them. I don't mind really. There's not a lot of people in there. There's a couple of peasants and all that. I think I'll muster some guys in a minute and go take that fort parcel thingy. I mean, it's been 20 turns and uh, you've only had to listen to me talking for a bit. <laughs> Overall for this video, and from what I've played with Gondor and my off-live kind of save that I got with the Free Peoples of Thingamajig and Aragorn and all that. It's, uh... I definitely recommend this mod. It's it's very nice, especially if you're a fan of uh, Lord of the Rings. I I wouldn't call myself a fan of Lord of the Rings. I just yeah, I don't know. I like it, but I'm not a. I wouldn't like watch them over and over again or anything. <laughs> Once I've seen him like one to three times over the course of like ten years, which I pretty much have, then. Uh, I won't really watch them again. I know what I know basically what's the base story of it. I'm gonna recruit most of my guys from up here. This guy is a woodsman, which is range. Yeah. Range again. And range again. So it looks like the Dalesman is what I'm going to be recruiting for now. Let's build myself up a little bit of a. Uh, protection, per se. So I can go off and crush some bandits, get some territory, and help the dwarves out a little bit. What I'm hoping is that the dwarves are too busy over to the east with the enemy, 
the, what we're going to call these guys, because I cannot, like, the run! We're going to call them the run, just because I'm really crap at pronouncing names from this game. Oh no! The orcs don't like me! Oh, my feelings, they are permanently scarred with the internal blades of hell. Nah, I'm only joking, I don't give a shit. Uh, I think for the purposes of, like, missile infantry... Well, you know, for the purposes of not going in debt. <laughs> I'll uh, leave that for now. I promise you guys, after this turns up, I shall attack somebody. Because attacking people is fun, fun, fun! Yeah. <sighs> you may hear my dogs barking in the background. Who needs doorbells, eh? Who needs doorbells? The dwarves have declared whatever. They've declared the truce. It's fine with me, I guess. They aren't. As long as they don't declare the truce with those guys and they, like, start focusing on me, which would be very bad. I don't really want to abandon that. Because that's the only thing at the border, kind of thing. But, uh, I'll send these guys over. Is he any kids yet? Coincidentally, that is the exact same character portrait as, uh, one of the Free Peoples of Endor, one of, like, Aragorn's kids. But we'll ignore that Let's for now. <laughs> Dale Swordsman, that's, like, their main powerful infantry. I don't mind leaving the main cities a little bit defenseless because they've got the uh, dwarves and the elves to defend. So yeah, they're not exactly what I'd call defenseless. Your will, my lord. My lord. Your orders, my lord. With honor. And this is at this point in the game that I wish I had a fan. But it would mess up with the fucking uh, voice recording thing and you'd constantly hear <laughs> in the uh, mic every like two seconds. Sorry if that burst anyone's eardrums, by the way. Yes, my lord. My bad. Assembling a, mighty host with Assembling a kind of mediocre host of your men, sir. Mediocre? I fucking ordered mediocre. I ordered awesome. This is ridiculous. This is an outrage. You will all rule the day you fucked with Dale Winklebottom. I have no idea what I'm talking about in case any of you guys are wondering. No idea whatsoever. Well, at least I don't have to worry about them getting past the dwarves, or maybe I do. Maybe they'll kick the shit out of the dwarves. I didn't really take that into account. I should probably like get over there and start helping them at some point. Yes, we shall continue tomorrow. Those guys can stay there just to, so I have a little bit of force up there still. My lord, I know what's there, so let's just keep this guy over there just in case, Tomorrow's so that I can see what's coming. Actually, no matter what, I'm going to see what's coming from that direction. If I put it up here, where there's another entry. Approaching quietly. Approaching that way I can see what's coming from all ways. Yay! Happy fun time! Happy fun time! A lie. It's not happy fun time. With honor. Okay. I could see this coming. <laughs> Now, if they attack the bandits, what I'm going to do is let them attack the bandits, weaken them, and in the process lose a bunch of their men, and then I'm going to attack them afterwards. 
be the optimist, uh, optimistic uh, vulture. That's the coward's way, ladies and gentlemen. You let your enemies destroy each other, and then you pick on the weakest one, and then beat the crap out of them. That's the way we do it in Dale, bitches. And in again. They're learning not to say anything. It's amazing. I really need to clean my keyboard a bit. It's got a bunch of dust on it. Uh, I've touched some of the keys. <laughs> the only keys that have absolutely no dust on them is W, A, S, and D. And the space bar. That's it. I'm just going to sort of let them kill each other for a bit. If you want endless fighting and losses of men and like death, you know, watch the Gondor videos. This video is peaceful and happy. Like a pink bunny on rabies. Or on like coke or something. I don't know. I don't do drugs. Oh shit. Um maybe I should have just attacked and took shelter inside the building. Your corpse will be thrown to the dog. Hey. Your corpse will be thrown to the dogs. Alright, that guy says something about my corpse. I don't like these people. I do not like these people. I'm going to, uh... Send some guys over here. This could be a really, really bad move. As you wish. March to exhaustion continue. Nevertheless, I'm determined that these guys will go join that army in order to help take over the bandits. Hopefully. What do the high elves want? Trade? I'll give you trade. Yes, trade in the alliance. That's good. I'll take that. We cannot sell that trade sense means sense more money. Sense. Alliance means Farewell. more help. Although they are all the way over the other side of the world. So, uh, yeah, they're not going to be that much help. Nah. Dave fucked off. Maybe they saw the elves coming or something. Or maybe they've gone to attack that big castle over there. Either way, these guys have barely any dudes. Your will, my lord. And there's like a bunch of guys there. So these guys can like take care of them. Marching to war. Beginning the siege. I always do one siege round and what turn two ladders, don't ask why. Yes. Yeah, by the looks of it, they've already taken that town. I'll stick uh, next turn and let my dog in the room. Come on, easy. In you get. I might leave that door open for a bit, actually. It's fucking hot in here. Oh, the joys of having a wireless mic. There are some joys. <laughs> Most of it's just... Ah, uh, shit, why did I buy my wireless mic? Yes, my lord. With honor! No good. They're, like, hardly defended whatsoever. Lord, so, I may cheat and just leave some men to take the fortifications. Orders, my lord. Your will, my lord. To war, then. Laying siege. We have them under siege. Orders. Yes, my lord. Your will, my lord. Yes. Just for good measure. Your orders, my lord. There's no senseless point in attacking them with my big army and just uh actually I could probably use that spy over here right now. That's that side of an outrider telling me where all my enemies are coming from.
All I have to do is hope that the uh, dwarves are giving them the hard time on the other side. And sending them to the other side. Damn hippies. They now have a general. Or well, did they have a general before? I have no idea. Oh, for the purposes of, like, not leaving you guys in boring yes, suspense and uh, boring the crap out of you with my constant chattering, okay. I shall attack. As I said in my previous videos, but for the sake of you guys that haven't watched them, I never really do auto-resolve unless there's, like, no point in me fighting on whatsoever and I'm all going to get annihilated. But, usually, for the purposes of the videos, I... Well, for the purposes of anything, really, I always despise or resolve I found it lacked the excitement and well it, it has made the game a hell of a lot more boring so yes I will not be doing auto resolve on any battles Units await my orders. why the fuck are the rangers got Stupid, don't do that. There you go. These guys can go like that. Everyone else can go over there. These guys can go on the road. These guys can be rangers, like they're supposed to be. And go like that. And these guys can just get behind them. I can't see anything because the sun is on my screen. I may be acting incredibly docile, but that's because of the pain medication. Nah, I'm not shit with you. Crap, these guys have like really long range. <laughs> like really, really long range. They're shooting from over there, but for oh, they might get more kills if they're closer. Let's do this, Leroy! Jenkins! Ah! Ah! The ladders are now in place. Right, Will, you useless motherfuckers. No the the These guys have place. a lot more, uh... Not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. Flipping. Did you say something about the enemy general falling, or my general falling? I wasn't paying attention. Go on, lads. Take them. Take to the castle walls. Leave no one alive. Rape the women. No, no joking. Don't rape the women. That was a joke. Our men have done well. The gates have fallen. the enemy's walls. Those guys could use some help. Our foolish general has thrown his life away. Perhaps our chances of victory win it. This could end badly. The enemy general lies dead. Unless we kill the enemy general and scare the shit out of him. Switch to fire. Scare him up a bit. Okay, let's 
aim there for the purposes of not shooting my own guys. Only half the enemy force remains. Uh -huh. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Why have they stopped fighting? Where the hell do those guys go? Did they all die? That's hard to believe. Hmm. That or they're all flanking those. Our men are in command. Our men no longer command the castle. Our men have taken control of the castle. Are you? What are these guys doing? Why the fuck are those guys on that side of the thing? <laughs> and my guys like really beat the crap out of them, didn't they? Without me like even realizing. We've lost half of our men. Nah, don't worry. They've lost like 90% of their men, so I'm pretty sure we're in the win. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Our men no longer command the castle. No, no, you do not flee. You do not flee. I hate it when they flee. For like no good reason. It's like, damn it, man, there's reinforcements coming. What are you doing running away? <laughs> Our men are in command of the car. This is a clear victory. Oh, yeah. Kind of. <laughs> well, we won. Bloody bandits. Those guys can take them quite easily, there's only a couple of them. Where's that spy of mine? There he is. My lord. Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey planned out. Orders. To war then. The troops are assembled. Prepare for battle. These guys really like flashy armor, don't they? Let us tell us ourselves in gold. Uh-huh. Let you die in red, bitch. Hmm. It just str struck me that these might be the guys of the Mamakai. Although they didn't dress in gold, did they? I have no idea. <laughs> Let's do this, Leroy! Hmm. Let's, like, not do what they expect me to do and go around that way.
quite sure why I selected only three of those guys, but there you go. Aha! We attack from the opposite direction! They shall never see this coming! Aha! <laughs> break down the walls! Break down the walls! I wonder if they like run straight over here once I start back ramming down the wall. Get through the enemy's walls, yep. into the breach, and on to victory. Hmm. Men of Dale. Watch my Dale's for the purposes of this video, we shall flank the fuckers! <laughs> Let's make sure I pick the right guys. Continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Good tidings. The enemy general lies dead. We've breached our enemy's walls. We've captured the enemy's walls. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Bloodied. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Slaughter. Slaughter! Be awed by the victory we have won here today! Oh yeah. Sure I outnumbered them, but my tactics were more superior, and therefore I call it a fair win. It was fair, damn it, don't look at me like that. How much cash do I do? Yes, I'll do that. Suck it. Suck it! Suck it! Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord.
Yeah, to the west of these lands should be the elves. Wood elves, whatever you want to call them. We'll just call them wood elves for the purpose of this video. Don't worry, I'll be taking that port in a minute, so there's no point in uh, doing that. Yeah, Gondor's allies with them as well. The Run have declared allies with Fingerdrig. Those idiots. Your orders, my lord. My lord. Your will, my lord. Orders. By your command. Yes, Some men behind. In. My lord. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my, my lord. Yes, my lord. My lord. Approaching quietly. I and I found my match. <laughs> Crap, I'm gonna need more men. I'm going to need more men. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. With honor. Yes. Making camp here. Your orders, my lord. And we wait for them to see what they do. Probably attack us with that giant army that I saw. Hmm. Well, I don't usually do adoption, and that guy's beard's fucking weird. But, uh... I need generals. Yes, my lord. Hopefully you won't get attacked on the way down here. Tomorrow. Your orders, my lord. If those idiots are stupid enough we to attack go? me. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. completely sure there's a wasp or a bee in my room. Or is that as a fly? I hate wasps. I don't mind bees. I hate wasps. Where is it? Probably safer behind the walls. I mean, funnel them into a kill box and just uh, focus on that. I think it's only a fly. I hate wasps. I despise wasps. Little ugly pieces of shit. Well, by the looks of it, they're like considering attacking me. Oh no! God 
forbid the Dark Lord of Mordor doesn't love me anymore, I may burst out into tears of joy. Did I say tears of joy? Oh no, uh, my bad. Uh, I, uh... Lord is my lord. With honor. That is the phone, that is the phone, that is the phone, that is the phone. Do 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 One two one two three. One two one two three. So the upkeep of these bastards is gonna be quite a lot. But they're not I don't think they're actually that much for upkeep, to be honest. They're kind of not very well trained. I think they're gonna like consider attacking me, but I don't think they will because I've got more men than they have. You know, unless if they have one of those elephant things, which is like near impossible to destroy. <laughs> you know, unless I had leg legless, which I don't. I think the elves of the wood uh, woodland elves have leg legless as a general. I remember as a family. I don't know. I haven't played them yet. They're just going to kind of sit there and uh, yes, my lord. wait, I think. Probably going to go bankrupt for a bit. From recruiting all these dudes. But if they have another army like that, and I... I don't know, I can hold off against an army like that. With... from Ravenport, but if they decide to go north, and I have to split off the men from... Whatever the hell that name is. <laughs> and go north with the more forces to defend that place, and then I get attacked by another huge force. But they're just going to sit there and scout me, I think. Yeah, I'm broke. He has the wine! The finest wine of Duruinian. Some say even uh, some even say of the whole Middle Earth. Hmm. Trust me to pick the place with the best alcohol. I not you can call wine alcohol, I don't mind it now and again. My right, well, we know that castle's there. Approaching quietly. Approaching Tomorrow's journey planned out. Hopefully, they'll just decide to scout me out for a little bit and not attack yet. He's probably waiting for reinforcements before he decides to attack, but, uh... Like I said, the game is on very hard difficulty, so the AI is not stupid. At least not as stupid as it would be on, like, normal difficulty or easy. Hell, if it was on easy, easy difficulty, I'd probably be able to, like, take the shit out of him by now. That's it. Just sit there. I'm, I'm in debt. I don't have enough money to fight right now. <laughs> Gondor has the best military, which means hopefully it's going to withstand better than I did. My pleasure. The AI is going to be better than me. That's a new one. Well, for now at least, I may as well send out these guys. I've spent like all my cash on. By your command, we'll make camp here, my lord. Orders. As you wish. Merging armies, my lord. Your will, my lord. My lord. March so hopefully that land over there is actually still dwarven land, and they haven't like taken it. I'm hoping. If I take that castle, actually. And uh, not only will I get more revenue from taxes, I should also, hopefully, maybe, ish, uh, be able to build some better infantry. Knights of Dale, or whatever they're called. Oh, crap. Like that. Like that, right there. <laughs> like what just happened right there. We are besieged. You heard that 
noise smack. That was me, uh, facepalm. Okay, at least I have an army on the way to that general direction. But I don't think they're going to be able to survive against that kind of attack. And knowing this really annoying game, it's not going to wait six turns for a surrender. Somebody's going to... I'm going to have to, like, withstand the assault or something. Uh, the only thing I can think of is attacking those guys and getting over there. But I don't think I'll be going to get over there fast enough. Fuck it. There's another thing with these saves. I don't, uh... I don't save and then reload kind of thing. So, if it fucks up and I get screwed, then it fucks up and I get screwed, there's nothing I can do about it. Other than saving so that I can come back to it later and do the other parts of the videos, I, uh... Eh, crap. I could survive. Maybe. Probably not. Attack! Yeah. The interbreeding of orcs and men. Fuck me. They don't actually mean breeding, do they? Because, uh... I don't want to know about that. Nobody look, children. Just, just cover it up. Just cover it up. No look. The tide of battle seems to have turned against us. I know the tide of battle has been turned against us, you fucked hard. <laughs> we are vastly outnumbered. No, that guy's on foot, apparently. He's an archer. Okay, I'm fucked. Did I mention that? Because I'm totally fucked. <laughs> I have, like, no military power. I have archers. That's about all I have. to get the shit being out of me. See if I can burn down this tower and be like incredibly lucky. Ah, oh, bollocks. They have ladders. They have ladders. I did not see that they had... Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. I'm screwed. I'm completely dead. If I was any more dead, this would not be funny. Ladders at the walls. Repel the attackers. Give them steel. Attack. The enemy are battering down the gates. The enemy siege tower has reached our walls. Ah, this is not going to be good. No idea where my reinforcements is, but it's taking the streets fucking time getting it. Yeah, 
is all the way over there in the forest. It's all the way over here, and it's walking for some fucking reason. We're going to be dead by the time you get here! The enemy's ram has breached the gates! Yeah, crap. Oh shit. <laughs> the feat seems almost certain. Well, if that bloody reinforcements got here faster. All I can do is watch as we die. The enemy have the walls. Look to our defense, or all will be lost. Almost certain. Okay, in the defensive stance, they run. General has thrown his life away. Perhaps our chances of victory win it. Rangers. Badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Our enemy has command of the castle. Lost control of the castle. A foe has taken control of the castle. Whether or not my reinforcements is going to uh, even survive. By the enemy. We must help his men avenge him. Our allies have fled the field like cowards. Pray something changes in the course of battle, for defeat seems almost certain. 
Yeah, we've lost. If we do not regain command of the castle now, we lose it. The enemy is no our enemy has command of the castle. Come on, let's kill his general before. General, kill his general, kill his general. At least I can kill his general with the arrows, so maybe. I'm lucky enough. Damn fast speed. Except my guys on the walls are getting their asses kicked. Pray something changes in the Come on, there's only three of them left. Feet seems almost certain. Have snatched Damn. victory from us like thieves in the night. We will not be so lucky next. Damn it all! Somebody's left my fucking door open. <laughs> that and uh, we've been completely destroyed. I have to send some men to deal with it. Hopefully, the men coming from the north can take them out from the men I've damaged. After the decline of the ransom, I don't have enough cash. over there. Ah, bollocks. Oh no, that's the same guy over there. Ugh, scared the crap out of me for a second. My lord. As you wish, we can go no further today. Your will, my lord. My lord. Your will, my lord. My lord. I'm probably going to regret doing this. Yes. March to exhaustion, continuing later. My lord. Approaching quietly. Because now he's on even ground with me. Kind of. Twenty quid says that he is X. Bet he does. Bet he does. There you go. What have I fucking tell you? Hand over the cash. We stand vigil as the enemy surrounds us. Second I send off a portion of my guys. Orders. Marching to war. Beginning the siege. Siege falls your will, my lord. By your command, we can go no further today. So I could really use the help from the elves right now, though, like right next to me, but uh, apparently they're too busy. In a situation like that, I'm screwed. <laughs> so, all resolve. I should have just kept my men over there. March to exhaustion. Continue orders. To war, then. Laying siege. We have them under siege. Bradley, we're going to go in about five minutes. 
Yes. <sighs> Fall back and oh, sweet Jesus. Huh? We he went off the siege there. We should withdraw. I have no time for your foolish missions. Your will, my lord. Marching to war. Give them no quarter this day, men. Take up arms and take victory! Take up arms and take cheese and pie. For the moment, the fortune of battle goes our way. Let's pray it remains as such. You never told which ones are on which side. Uh, go that wall, and you go that wall. These three men there. That one dude in the middle there. And these guys here. Once again with the running rabbit. Right yeah, so I've been informed that I'm uh, supposed to be leaving in like five minutes, so after this game, after I've retaken this settlement, we'll have to end the video there. The ladders are now in place. Walls are no match for the valor and force of our arms. The battering ram is in place. It'll not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. Battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Our soldiers have proved their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us now. has done its work. Yes, I am aware that we are going to stop repeating it.
men are in command of the castle. We've lost control. Yes, of the castle. Jesus Christ, woman! I'll be there in a minute. Yeah, if I can kill somebody. Good tidings. The enemy general lies. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Yep, and I click continue out of rage. God damn it. Be awed by the victory we have yeah. won here Is today. that bastard revenged? Revenge? Revenge. <laughs> we are victorious. We have conquered, my lord. Okay, guys, we leave it here because I have to go. Evidently, as you've already heard. So, I will stick up the rest of the video soon, and so out. See you guys around.